Welcome back to the next video guys. What is the most overlooked and ignored PC component for any new builder? Let's find out. So with native PCI 5.0 and 5.1 certification, which does come with an included 12 volt high power connector for the 40 series GPU from, from NVIDIA. So that means it'll support the 4070, 4080, the 4090, 4090 Ti, it, all the supers, and it will support 600 continuous watt power outage. And of course, this does have Japanese capacitors, very good quality capacitors. The overall fan is a 13.5 centimeter fluid dynamic bearing, so the fan does obviously have that good quality bearing. You won't have to worry about that actually dying out of the box now it does come in two different colors black and white i personally prefer the white but that's just me and it does have strong output stable current from dc to dc conversion it does of course have a single 12 volt rail the the single 12 volt rail is rated for 12 volts at 70 amps at 840 watts it does have quick response double rectifier a bridge plus customized pcb board and pcb direct connection also it's 80 plus gold certified so it's safe to say that if you own a 40 series graphs card this power supply will definitely do it it is actually being sold by scan it's at 99 pound which i think for a 80 plus gold certification on a power supply at 850 watts if you were thinking 10 years ago that would be really cheap and to be honest the way power supplies are going they're getting cheaper and cheaper but the efficiency levels are getting much better with time so at least with this power supply you wouldn't have to worry about it dying because it has that 80 plus certification as well as it is the 5.8 or and 5.0 certification you saw the video now i've given you some specific specifications for this particular power supply here from gam max now what i will tell you is the most underrated and overlooked pc upgrade that any newbie always overlooks and it's always the power supply actually buying a very good quality power supply usually they spend maybe 50 to 60 quid maybe a bit more on a house play that's not a good or well-known brand now take this one for instance for 99 pound on scan it's 80 plus certified 80 plus gold it has pci e gen 5 and gen uh, 5.1 it also has atx gen 3 and gen 3.1 so for 99 pound you get this type of quality component for 99 pound now this specific model here does come with that infamous 600 watt 12 uh, 12 volt high power cable as you can see by there 600 watts so this is compatible with the rtx 3070 80 90 90 ti and that's the cable now i'm not a fan of these cables i don't like this cable but because this is actually included in the box, it wouldn't look as bad. Now, when it comes to this particular unit, now, I've got no actual specialised equipment like a PSU tester here because they cost an absolute fortune. But, in a way of testing it is loading up on my test, my, my main editing system I use here to edit my videos, which is a Ryzen uh, 9 7900. It's got 32 gigs of Ares DDR5, it's got a B650 motherboard, it's got an RX 7800 XT Nitro Plus, it's got Thermaltake fans, it's you know, it's got the Noctua NH uh, D15 Gen 2. So, I clocked using this power supply around 800 watts. I'm no expert when it comes to power supplies, but one thing I do know is you are not to open these, these up yourself unless you've got a certification or you know what you're actually doing then you do not open these up because if there's charging the capacitors it can kill you so make sure you bear that in mind but 
I thought this was an interesting video because I see it all over Facebook. People asking, oh, what graphics card should I get? What motherboard? What CPU? But no one actually asks what type of power supply they should get. Now, this one from Gamax. Big thank you to them sending it out. It's a very good quality unit. Now, if we were talking 10 years ago, to get 80 plus gold rating, you would be spending two, two, 250 pound plus just for an 80 plus gold rated power supply but we're not 10 years ago we're in the current year i think for 99 pound you also get that peace of mind that it comes with the 600 watt cable included it also it also is 80 plus gold now to get that type of certification you have got to put they do put it through a lot of tests and personally i think this looks gorgeous now it, this one is fully modular for 600 uh, for 99 pound you get a fully modular power supply that back even five years ago you'd be paying a premium for so if you want to buy this power supply then it gets my stamp of approval and my recommendation and when i do a all white pc build in the future this is the one i'm going to be using so if you want to buy it the link for scan as well as amazon will be down below and i'd like to say a big thank you to gamax for sending this out i hope to further this uh, relationship to down in the near future and me looking at other products of theirs so as always don't forget to subscribe because i have got so much stuff coming it is not funny anymore i've got stuff coming from id cooling pc cooler i've got some new products come from thermal grizzly i've got another aio coming from thermal right then, of course, I've got the target monitor to do. I've got the uh, NVMe S S the NVMe heatsink from Akasar to do. I have got so much stuff on at the moment, it's unbelievable. So make sure you subscribe. This is Richard Welshek. I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend and week ahead of you. Good. Bye.